All right, so lesson 86 is on the area of a circle. So here we have a circle drawn on a grid, and it wants to know about how many units or how many units is the radius of a circle, and then estimate the area of the circle. So first we're going to do the radius. So remember, my radius is from the inside of my circle to the edge. So if we count how many units that is, that's one, two, three units. So my radius is equal to three units. Okay. Now for B, we need to estimate the area of the circle. That just means it wants us to count how many um, square units are inside my circle. So we're first going to count up the whole squares, okay, the ones that are almost all the way there. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So I have 22 whole units, okay, and now I need to add my half units, okay. So the ones I have, oh, I missed two. So it's 22, 23, 24, excuse me. So 24 whole units. Now I need to add up the half units so I can get close. So the ones that are half, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if I have eight half units, that's the same as four whole units. I'm going to add another four units. So 24 plus four is equal to 28. Now remember with units and with area, we need to square the label. So my answer is about 28 square units is the area of my circle. Okay. Now here we have the radius of a circle is 3 centimeters. What is the area of the circle? Use 3.14 for pi and then round it to the nearest square centimeter. So in this case, if you remember, the area of my circle is equal to pi times the radius squared, pi r squared. So let's go ahead and put in my, in my numbers. So that is equal to 3.14, okay, that's pi, times by the radius, which is 3 squared. So we first are going to do my square, because square comes first. So it's going to be 3.14 times by 3 squared is 9. So let's go ahead and do that. 3.14 times by 9. 9 times 4 is 36. Carry my 3. 9 times 1 is 3. Plus, or 9 times 1 is 9, plus 3 is 12, carry my 1. 9 times 3 is 27, plus 1 is 28. Okay. Then we're going to count over the decimal place. 1, 2, 1, 2. So my answer is, and it wants us to the nearest square centimeter. So the nearest square centimeter is going to be this number, my 8. So I'm going to look, am I going to round it up or down? It's going to stay the same. That is equal to 28 centimeters squared. Now, if you notice, this answer is the same as this answer. So the circle we just did was the same circle we did in this previous problem. Okay. The only difference is that we multiplied it by pi, because pi is about 3. Okay. So that's how we find the, radius, the area of a circle. Okay. So last problem. I calculate the area of the circle with a radius of 4 centimeters. So remember, the area of my circle is equal to pi r squared. So put in the numbers. Pi is 3.14. And we're going to multiply that by pi r squared. r is 4 centimeters. And we're going to, four meter, we're going to square it. 4 squared. Okay. So again, 3.14. We're going to multiply that by 4 squared, which is 16. Okay. So we're going to do 3.14 multiply by 16. Erase these to get them out of the way. Alright, so 6 times 4 is 24. Carry my 2. 
6 times 1 is 6, plus 2 is 8. 6 times 3 is 18. Add my 0. 1 times 4 is 4. 1 times 1 is 1. 1 times 3 is 3. Add these together. 8 plus 4 is 12. Carry my 1. 8 plus 2 is 10. Carry my 1. 3 plus 2 is 5. Now count over the decimal place. 1, 2, 1, 2. So the area of my circle is equal to 50.24 centimeters squared. And that's all. Good luck on your homework.